Good day fellas, I hope you are ready for your extra daily dose of skill and today we are playing with Matilda Bled Prince. Kind of forget and tank to be fair with you. Um, I played recently quite a bit in the lower tiers and to be fair with you I'm not seeing those at all. Um, which is kind of understandable considering the top speed of this vehicle is 22 km per hour so probably in order to make it work in the current meta you kind of need to have turbo and yeah the gun alpha is not that great and the tank is kind of dead in a way right um it is like a history of world of tanks and uh, funny fact in the past matilda bled uh, prince or uh, um however you would love to call this vehicle it used to be awesome in my opinion it used to be one of the better uh, premium tanks i know it sounds weird but it was relatively easy to play you know you are having quite a bit of armor uh, gold ammo back in the day wasn't so accessible not many people were spamming apcrs right um, and you were feeling somehow decent anyways uh let's teleport into the game and let's see what this vehicle is all about shall we and we are back in the game um we are in the safe heaven map against the tier um against the tier six tier fives but we are going to be all right also quick mention fellas for index page if you are curious about equipment setup expectation values for um masters or expectation values for um for overall mark of excellence feel free to check it out it costs nothing and hopefully you will get quite a bit of information fellas so what do we want to do we want to go into the city for obvious reasons now since meta is quite quick nowadays as you can see while going uh, 20 kilometers per hour speed yeah yeah fellas mm-hmm that's what I'm talking about. It feels truly slow. Um, and this is one of the problems of this vehicle. And I believe it is kind of fixable if we would use turbo. And in fact, we might try to do so um, after this game. Maybe we could replace um, optics for a turbo. I am thinking about this. This could um, work pretty well, fellas. Anyways, uh, what is the goal for us? Obviously, we want to get involved into the battle somehow. It might take a couple of minutes until we will arrive. But whenever we will arrive, we will show the dominance, my friends. That's the plan. That's the hope. That's the dream. Um, and in fact, I believe um, we are going to have a great time fighting against this T-28. Now, what is good thing about this vehicle? Uh, the good thing about this tank would be... Uh, obviously DPM, right? DPM is not looking bad whatsoever. Alpha damage, yeah, alpha damage is kind of weak, but whenever you are making that alpha damage work, right? Whenever you are 75, 75, 75, 75. In fact, speaking about the gun, what do we have, boys and girls, ladies and gentlemen? Um, we have the penetration values with a standard ammunition of 110 millimeters of penetration, which is not bad whatsoever. And the gold penetration is 180 and that's actually pretty damn good you can penetrate majority of the tier um, seven tanks without bigger problems whatsoever and this is definitely worth thing to highlight my friends this is definitely worth thing to highlight so at this point what we are doing we are thinking how to get involved against the enemies here and we are going to make it work i am pretty sure we are going to make it work so Meanwhile, we are paying attention at this game, right? We are paying attention at the angles and hopefully we are going to be able to farm them like there is no tomorrow. There is a pixel shot from here and obviously we are trying to use uh, this in our favor for obvious reasons. Since Skoda is beating the living crap out of the other side, we can show some dominance against the higher tiers here. And it works well if you would ask me. I get the point M6 uh, he has the um, uh, small PP right, and his DPM could be alright, but I don't really mind. I don't really mind to shoot non-stop. And once again, when we arrived in the game, it did not went that bad. You can't say it was absolutely disgusting, but you see, if 
if fellas you are not able to reach the tanks which can definitely happen okay i'm speaking from experience speaking about the world of tanks how the things are looking like uh yeah boys and girls ladies and gentlemen holy effing yeah that's a traffic uh, traffic jam i repeat that's a traffic jam boys and girls ladies and gentlemen holy guacamole Okay, let's try to go. Fellas, I know, I know, I know, I know. Let me go. Holy bananas, fellas. Let me go, fellas. Obviously, you do not want to get hit by the gentlemen who are shooting with APCR ammunition, okay? I want to be honest with you. This tank weak spot in a way is a turret as many other, to be fair with you, lower tier tanks. For example, Churchill, um, Churchill 3 has the same situation, right? So keep this in mind. Okay, so far so good. I am very excited and I'm very happy with our performance. I think we made it work. Now, the thing is, I do not really think we can be involved here that much. Um, never mind, I changed my mind. We can be involved as much as we want. Yeah, this is looking like it is a game over unless in some kind of magical way we are going to reach uh, enemies. But this is going to be a long 5 kilometers per hour drive, so let's teleport into the scoreboard, fellas, shall we? And we are back, fellas, in the scoreboard. As expected, we did not manage to reach anyone, but that's understandable. Look at this. We have Ace, 1.3 thousand damage, 1.4 thousand assisting damage, 1.2 base experience, and we are third by the, um, by the damage as well, which is pretty good. And funny fact, we made quite a bit of credits, if you would ask me. Uh, I don't know, fellas. Uh, I would say that was an amazing first game. Let's go for a game... You know what? Before everything, how about if we would replace the optics for turbo, okay? How about if we would replace optics for turbo? I get the point we are going to be semi-blind, but at least we are going to be a bit quicker. So let's try to test this tank in this way. Let's teleport into the round number two. And we are back, fellas. So this time we have pretty similar matchmaking. We have a tier 6, tier 5, tier 4. So once again, everything is looking alright. And let's see, is this tank feeling faster with a turbo? Honestly... Indeed it does. Uh, obviously, jokes aside, I don't really think this tank feels so much quicker. So, the question is, is the turbo worth it on this tank? Uh, the view range uh, before wasn't ideal by any means, and I do not really think the uh, view range is ideal um, even now, okay? I do not really think the view range is that uh, um, epic on this vehicle, which is quite sad thing, but once again, nothing what you can do. You see, lower tiers, most of the lower tiers, they are blind. Even tank destroyers, they do not have um, a good view range, and that's understandable, but... What this tank has. Awesome alpha damage. Well, I don't really think being sarcastic while playing with Matilda Bled Prince is working that well. What do you think, fellas? What do you think? Okay, what is our goal? Our goal is to... Um, Enter the heavy line and hopefully we can support our Ikea or Su-85 so we can eliminate Kava 1, Hetzer or Skoda. You know, we just need to get involved into this battle. And as you can see, this gentleman is feeling the same way probably. He's thinking, what the flying F is happening here? This is how he is feeling like, oh, he has a small PP. We are not PP shaming here, just saying, fellas. We are not PP shaming. What we are going to do now, we are going to get involved even more. I know, I know, skill, this is aggressive. Absolutely, yes, it is. And I am feeling pretty happy with, uh, um, with my decision and with my performance. So, at this situation, all we need to do, we need to use our DPM and our burst of fire for obvious reasons. 
right that's what we need to do beautiful this is exactly what i wanted to do and we pretty much beat the living crap out of the tier 6 which is always nice and always welcome for mr hetzer i am going to load the uh, gold ammunition not to mess up my shot but you know what uh there is a bad uh, thing skill what is bad thing well his gun i will never ever see him ever again in my life and uh, he is gun okay whenever you are playing with the tanks which has speed of this vehicle you need to keep this in mind everything is going to go very slowly so you need to have this attitude of not being crazy mother trucker and running I want to be here <coughs> I want to be here 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 maybe I want to be here and I want to go into the middle and end now this tank is completely different and you cannot do things like this oh gift from my father in war gaming nice um, with this tank, whenever you are picking the side where you want to play, you are going to one side and you are going to finish your battle in that side as well, okay? So keep this in mind. Um, this is very, very important thing to say and to mention overall. Meanwhile, open your eyes, fellas, and look for a windows. This is overall extremely good advice for um, any tank out there. You know, instead of going like this and opening myself, I used window to be the living crap out of this gentleman. Um, and call me dirty, but that worked pretty well. At this point, I am considering going into the cab. And the main reason why am I considering going into the cap myself is because um, enemies are very, very close for our cap as well. So, by doing this, hopefully we are going to distract enemies and hopefully we will get a lot of, a lot of use for ourselves. Uh, capping in the open field is not ideal, uh, but we will try to make it work. We will try to make it work. We are going to use this uh, dead tank in order to get some use of the incoming guys like this. This is very important thing to say. And let's try to get some use. I have a feeling he can one shot me. That's not very good, is it? One more. Good. We are just capping the base at this point. At this point, we are waiting until enemies will mess up. That's what we need to do. That's it. We cannot do anything. We need to wait. We need to be patient here, fellas. Good. We are sitting on the 2,000 damage already. I mean, once again, think about this situation, fellas. Two bloody thousand damage with this tank. I don't know what do you want me to say. I do not know what do you want me to say, fellas. I would rate this battle extremely well. Performance-wise, I would rate this battle very, very well. I know the T-67 is coming for us. I am very, very well aware of that. Uh, but in the same time, I don't really think we can do anything about this. Apart sitting here and uh, um, crossing our fingers, we are going to be fine. That's only one thing what we can potentially do. Hmm. Okay. That's only one thing what we can potentially do. Patience. Oh. Good. Now this gentleman should come for us. He is on his way. One. Two. Three. Four. You know what is the funny thing of all this? Uh, this enemy Afaka tank did not even, not even he gave us a personal farm. But in the same time, this gentleman just uh, pretty much said for enemies, okay, okay guys, I was a fucker, I made a cover for the enemy tank, he captured the base and he slaughtered two tanks. This is how everything went. Absolutely madness, fellas. Um, yeah, quite uh, a quality video with Matilda Bled Prince, if you would ask me. Absolutely insanity. Okay, let's see. 
first of all, we are quickly saying thanks for um, Brother Nars medal. Thanks, mate. Have a nice day. Beautiful. And now we can go. So what do we have? We have Ace. We have the Invader. We have High Caliber. We have Brother in Arms. And we finish it with 1.5 base experience and 2.6 thousand damage. And 75 thousand profits. I don't know what to say, fellas. This is absolutely insane and crazy. So, in the end of our session, we have 2,000 average damage with Matilda, Blade Prince, and 700 assisting damage. Fellas, if the session is not worth like, I don't know what is. Anyways... Thank you very much for watching. That was your daily dose of skill. I think we made this tank work pretty well. And I hope you were entertained. And maybe you are going to go for one or another round with your Matilda Blood Prince, which you have to get somewhere deep in the garage. So once again, thank you. And see you very, very soon. Skill is out for today. Peace.